Okay, guys, we're gonna make a review on Mega Mind 2. So, if you wanna know, Mega Mind 2 was very bad. It was awful. The, okay, so let's get started on the animation. The animation is whack. You can see it. It does not look like what Mega Mind 1 and how good it was and all the villainy stuff and all that. It was great, great plot, everything. This movie has animation like a two-year-old TV show that came out last last night who, who are still trying to make the the move the show it's it's the animation like it's so bad like when you talk about the animation it it's very bad the animation is whack because the color the the colors are very, very look like a preschool show that came out last night. Like I told you, the 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 colors are lot are kind of like the colors of this of this random Mickey toy that my brother has. These colors are absolutely awful. the The colors are absolutely awful. Dreamers did not do a good job on their animation. I know, I know it, it it was supposed to be a TV show, but then they absolutely booted it and the thing. But I'm actually seeing responses that are actually pretty good about the thing. They actually like the animation. It's their opinion, but I watched it. The animation was trash. So let's get on on the story. So Megamind is is a hero from Mega Mind One, and he and he went in an interview, and this and this little lady girl, who's literally like thirteen years old, is literally trying to let Mega Mind be her assistant. But Mega Mind absolutely drop kicks her and says you sh and says that you are thirteen and get and go watch cartoon 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 shows he absolutely roasted her but i can't believe he actually roasted her bro he roasted her so hard like yeah she she was still tempted and she made a youtube video enough of mega mind you actually make videos on mega minds uh but but the, it's whack. So, so they they go and they and they apps and Mega Mind absolutely um, fires his assistant. So his little so his assistant is is now jobless. And that and that interviewer hates her job for some reason. Um, I don't know. I like interviewing. It's kind of cool. But, so she doesn't like her job, and she wants to be Megamind's new assistant. New assistant. So, so Megamind hires her, and then that fish dude is down. I feel bad for him. But then these, but then these literal fish guys are coming, are coming, and, and trying to, to take this special fish I can't believe it. A special fish. What? Like, why do you need a special fish? I am so unbelieved about that. No, I'm being sarcastic. Oh my God. That is, OMG, that is so bad. So, so, so bad, that villain. Their colors are absolutely trash. The colors of those villains are trash. But then, of course, Mega Mine saves them, saves the fish, cause it's it's valuable, I guess. So, so then their older 
um, villain assistants hear about this and all, and they all meet each other and all in their lair and all laugh that they that they think it's a joke that Mega Mind got that little key of the old thing that he's a savior because he saved all of that because he saved um the the city from a monster because yeah he's he's good so mega mine 2 right there you, you can see how bad that plot is first of all and bro it, it's the, the plot is like this let me where let me oh sorry guys let me let me see if i can be be a superhero yeah 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 i get this random key thing like how is that a good plot how like if you are trying to make a good plot you have to make that that is probably the worst plot i've ever seen it's not the worst because there's other bad movies that i'll talk about in a couple um minute uh in a couple more videos but that was just awful all of that let's go into the the review the review so if i would give this i would give it a three out of ten the voice acting oh i forgot will ferrell's not there so so he's trying to make the best best impression of will ferrell and it's horrible oh ah, ah, ah. that's how he, that's how he talks in the movie it's so bad and all of that i remember in megamind one it was so cool like villainy and all that they just went downhill with megamind 2 and if i would rank this i would give it a free out of time because it has a couple good moments but it's very very bad for the first part bye bye guys everybody i hope you had a good time with me reviewing the megamind 2 and if you like it, you like it. You like it. I know a lot of you you would like Mega Man 2, but this is my personal opinion. And don't say my opinion is your opinion. You watch the movie yourself. Mega Mind versus the Doom Syndicate. So yeah, you go watch it and you find your opinion. This is just my opinion. Bye guys.